Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing the Moza proposal on Genesis. We'll do it on Gamma because we're just going to go for the tech gauntlets this time. And you'll find this mission in the ocean biome at 3055. That's 3055. Time for We're going to need a squid and either a scuba tank or a tech helmet. The aim of the mission is to follow the quote unquote footprints. These are actually fin prints of the Moza. Collecting them all as you go along, and then fight the Moza right at the end. I find it easier to be in first person when on the squid, and if you go at night, it's a lot easier to see these little fin marks for you to follow all the way through the ocean. There's only two or three routes available that they go through. Most of them are pretty self-explanatory and straightforward. You just need to follow everything until you get to the Moza. Here you see the Moza just coming into view. You automatically highlight it red as an enemy and then you just go ahead and attack it until the bar on the right hand side goes down about a third. As you see here, the local wildlife can attack you also. It's up to you whether you either ignore it and take the damage or you go ahead and kill it. Personal preference on this one. As you can see, it was pretty easy to kill the Moser or damage the Moser at that point. Um, Helene will then scan for nearby trails and then you go ahead and follow the direction at which you need to go. Sometimes it's useful to flip between third person and first person just to find that next one so you know where the trail starts and then go back into first person and follow it straight. She came at me from above this time, but fair enough, she's still going to be taking a little bit of damage fairly quickly, especially on Gamma, doesn't take much. We're only really here for the tech gauntlets. Sometimes you do need to pause to let the next set of tracks load in. So here they are here, just going down to the left now. Relatively straightforward to be honest. And if you get to a point like this where the trail doesn't load up, it means you haven't got enough trail tracks from before. So do yourself a favour, either collect them properly on the way and make sure you get enough, or just boost back, follow the trail backwards and make sure that you ticked enough in the top corner out of 73 on this occasion to make sure that it's viable and it will allow you to spawn in the final boss at the end. So 
So as you can see here, I've got 62 out of 73. 63 now. That's going to be enough to summon the boss in. So here he is, she is, and we're just going to go and attack that now. It also has two Leoporidons that come and help it, which are easy enough to kill too. And that's it. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Now that's what I call a hunt!